guys so i am really excited because i finally get to look at my spotify rap 2021 i did do a reaction to my spotify rap 2020 so i will link that down below i'm just very excited i'm filming this on my phone this shouldn't make too much of a difference for you it might be flipped around but basically i know you don't care but i'm just gonna explain anyway i haven't updated spotify on my phone for like over a year because i hated how they updated it on the your library page so i kept how it is on my phone but then it doesn't like work properly like the spotify wrap so i have to do it on my ipad anyway i think it's going to be quite different to last year so this year was anything but normal i don't know whether to turn the sound down because i don't want to get copyrighted well, all too well it's basically just taylor swift at the moment just see red taylor swift all too well obviously it's just i was just preparing for the 10 minutes and i fell in love with this song sparks fly yeah fell in love with that song this year as well oh bobby tarantino 3 theme for the people i didn't even listen to that song that much but okay in 2021 you did what you had to oh it's playing skin so you spent 42,000 minutes listening that's more than 91% of others in the UK. I'm not going to lie, I did think, I actually got my prediction right. I thought it was going to be around 42,000 minutes. Like, it definitely wasn't going to be as much as last year. I think last year mine was like 80, nearly 90,000 minutes. Definitely wasn't going to be as much as last year because I was more locked up last year. But that's what I thought. That's still a good amount. All too well, yeah. Your top song of the year was all too one. I mean, all too well. I'm like, okay, all too well by Taylor Swift. Of course, I listen to that song so much. And now is it, it would be the 10 minute version. You played it a very reasonable 224 times. That doesn't actually sound that much when you think about it. Like, that's not even once every day. Anyway, but there's still a decent amount of time. Oh, Save Your Tears remix. That wasn't the only song in your rotation. Oh, top songs. <gasps> oh! that is mm, that is strange my most played song was all too well as we see second was save your tears remix with ariana grande i love that song i i did think that would be my top five because i have listened to that so much it's just it's just so good third is happier than ever i'm not surprised because that is billy's best song i don't listen to her loads but that's definitely a best song and i listen to that a lot i'm surprised about four and five though better than revenge by taylor swift like oh it's just a good song though i don't even know why it's fourth though i don't even listen to it that much and survive the moog i think i just listened to that loads at the start of the year because at the start of the year i'm pretty sure I watched Shameless US, although I watched Shameless UK before, obviously, but I watched Shameless US and that was in the soundtrack of Shameless US and I fell in love with the song and I just kept playing it and playing it. I remember I used to, this is so weird, but I used to like, when I needed the bathroom before I went to sleep, I'd get out of bed, put this song on, just sit on the toilet and feeling like, you know, some kind of scoundrel. I don't even know what, oh, okay. Just sitting on the toilet. Anyway, you didn't need to know that. You deserve a playlist as long as your skincare routine. Uh, that's not... Why are they assuming I even have a skincare routine? Like, sorry, I don't look after my skin. I'm excited to see my top 100 songs of the year. I will look at it after. Listen to 41 different genres this year, but we would have proud. We would have been proud even if you exclusively listened to well sounds. Like, is Spotify trying to be funny? Because they're actually not. Like, I don't know what they're trying to do. My top genres... What? <laughs> what the fuck? Uh, am I okay? Number one dance pop, two pop rap. What is this Kentucky hip hop? Is that because I'm listening to Jack Harlow all the time? Sorry. And then fourth Detroit hip hop. Sorry, is that Big Sean? And then five DMV rap. What's that like car rap? Like, no, that's not the car rap. That's like where you go about your license in that. DMV rap. I don't even know what that is. Him, you listen to 104 different artists. But things got pretty serious with one. I just saw it was Taylor Swift. Oh, I'm so proud of myself. I'm sorry. I was in a top 0.5%. That's pretty good considering how popular she is. First word. You listen to a total of 10,000. That's 
a quarter that's a quarter of all my listing like nearly a quarter of all my listing with taylor swift what the hell oh it's playing never take it to anyone pilots i did oh i want to see top artists that's actually embarrassing <laughs> i'm actually embarrassed like first of all taylor swift to the pilots fine that's calm madison dear i do like her like i do love her but like why is she on actually no because life support came out this year and it was a good album okay i don't even care what you say it was a banging album gone in red yeah if it could go quite banging album but i'm so embarrassed that demi the Vato was on here i do not like demi Lovato. like i just don't like them okay the album dancing with the devil it was all right yeah i listened to it quite a bit and i listened to the song train wreck quite a lot train wreck and la la land from the album la la land i think no no it was not the album la la land the album don't forget but why is demi lovato in my top five hey, fuck off i don't like you i know demi wouldn't care that i don't like them but still i need to like block them out my list because they're just not a good person. Anyway, I don't understand how 21 Pilots my second. I'm not very happy that Jack Harlow isn't in my top five. That's actually disrespectful. So this is like the second year where I haven't had a rapper on there. Like, it's like, I don't listen to rap, but I do. Like, where's Jack Harlow? Like, to be fair, I didn't listen to NF much this year. But where's Jack Harlow? Like, i <laughs> pissed off. I'm pissed off. Anyway, it's not that deep. At least Taylor Swift was number one. At least Auto World was number one. Like, amazing. <gasps> I almost forgot. I almost forgot. Oh my gosh, I can't believe this. I didn't look at my playlist for the year. I am very curious. What we're going to see here. Auto World, Save Your Tears. We've got Happier Than Ever. And then the one after Survive was Good and Good Buy It. Sorry. Ugh, that's not even a good Madison B song. What the fuck? Okay, it's not a terrible song, but like, it's not even one of her like very good songs. Like, she's got a song so much better than that. Anyways, we got Clouds, You're Not Sorry, Taylor's Version, Understandable, We're Good, Dua Lipa, Feeling Good, Muse, <laughs> amazing song, You Should Be Sad, Haunted, Lost, Melon Cake. Melon Cake's a good song by Demi, okay. Boy Shit, love that song. Speak Now, <laughs> Skin. Sabrina, I'm not gonna lie, I actually really like that song. Um, what other people say, good song, Blue, mm, Forever and Always, Love on the Brain, that's a joke. Ego, Ego by the Saturdays is a classic. Spotify, Buddy Mind. We've got Muse, more Madison B, more Taylor, more Gull and Red. I've got Jesse Reyes, Lil Nas X, Jack Harlow, some Olivia Rodrigo, some I'll Get on My Dick, J. Cole, amazing. You're Not Sorry, the normal version, um, or not Taylor's version, more J. Cole, I Dreamed a Dream, Season Boyle, okay. Potential breakup song, we've got Champagne Problems, more Taylor's version stuff, Los Cools, Billy Eilish, more Garden Bread, Man of the Year, Log Logic, mm, Killer, Eminem, Machine Gun Kelly, mm. Title Track is a really good song though, Cool Summer, Death by a Thousand Cuts, those are the two songs that are amazing from Lover, okay, What's Poppin' Jack Harlow, of course, Peace of You, Shawn Mendes, that's one of the best songs from Wonder, okay, Reckless Madison Beer, sorry, I'm just going through this, this is interesting, that's a pretty good playlist i guess <laughs> the way to say i guess so thank you so much for watching let me know your top five artists top five songs how many minutes you listened and all that jazz and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you later bye